You ever play it's Borderlands? Awesome. No, I, I I don't really. I started. I picked up Death Stranding yet. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna play Death Stranding. That one seems boring to me, bro. It, There's it's so very, it's very boring. I finally got to the actual game. It's like four and a half hours of credits. You think the credits are over, and then it's like you're you. Oh, I guess I'm not playing again. I guess it's another forty five minutes of like movie happening. <laughs> yeah, like, fuck that, here, dude. Here's Guillermo del Toro in a special guest starring role <laughs> in a video game. What? The you don't get a gun till like twenty hours in. Shut was playing that shit. It looked so boring. But I don't know, man. Games like that are, you know, not... Uh, one of the best games I ever played was the original Mass Effect. Never played it. In the sense of, like, like scope and, like, open-ended fucking rainy space opera bullshit. Right. And yeah. you can get pussy in that one, right? You can be gay, too. Yeah, but for the most... Not the first one. The first one is mostly, like, just fucking figuring out how rude you can be to aliens to get information out of them. <laughs> Which is what appeals to me about it. <laughs> it's just I can so see that. Because you can mix like the nice and mean responses in the original Mass Effect. And it's like, tell me more about this shadow broker. You know, and they're like, well, the shadow broker is known for his knowledge of information around the galaxy. <laughs> right. If you want to know something, you blah, 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 blah. And it's like. Thanks a lot for that information. Of course. At any time, you'd like to stop by my shop, and then you can select like the shut up option. You're like, I don't care about this. You're like, oh. <laughs> oh. I'm okay. I'm sorry. sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that, I see how that appeals to you, man. That's the way you, that's the way you live your life. Yeah. You just, <laughs> once you get the info, you're like, shut the fuck up, bitch. Shut up, dude. Yeah, I wish I could go back and play the original Mass Effect. You could, man. I'm sure they did a remaster or something. It's just games. You play games. You the games are a lot of fun, and then you go back and play them. And I thought for a while because I used to do it with like Nintendo 64 games or like PlayStation 2 games. Mm -hmm. You go back and play them, and you think like, oh, it's because the graphics sucked or something. Right. But no, it's just like, yeah, the moment's gone. The, the moment, magic's gone. It's gone, dude. Life is like that, though, dude. There's so much intangible shit that you love, like. You can see a movie in a time in your life and it kicks, it sucks you off. It's the best. And then you go back, you're like, what the fuck? There's nothing good here. Yeah. There's so many fucking variables. Yeah. No, sucks. Yeah. I hate knowing that. It's crazy because then I think about like how fucking good a game has to be to make me like love it. Like, uh, there'll probably be nothing I care for more in my life than Red Dead Redemption 2. <laughs> yeah, that game is so good. It's fucking amazing. Did you finish it? No, I got too, I got bored. You got bored of it? Well, it's not that I got bored. It's that I was playing it on the stream and like there's something to just playing a game without having to entertain anyone and just zoning in for like eight hours at a time that I wasn't getting the opportunity to do. I was playing it because I started playing it when we got back from Australia the first time. Yeah. That's when I got, when it came out while we were there. And then I was like horrifically depressed. Right. I would just fucking like sit in the living room and play Red Dead Redemption until like 6 a.m. Yeah. I remember you would do the show while playing Red Dead. Yeah, and it's like that felt great, dude. Yeah. Just camping in the woods and hunting and. Oh yeah, it feels awesome. Yeah, dude, just just hunting, just feeding yourself off the land. Nothing but you and a couple arrows. You don't need anything else. Nothing but you and your apartment and your PlayStation Four. That's right. And your pretend <laughs> horse that you have to brush. Right. Your pretend horse that you have a better relationship with than any living, breathing thing in the yeah. world. My girlfriend's just in the other room crying. I'm like, what is it? And then it's just... Woo, 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 woo. It's like, yeah, I'm not... No, I know. I, oh, shit, the legendary fox. Yeah. Oh, I got to catch the legendary fox. Sorry, I got I to gotta scalp this native. <laughs> there should be more of like brutal native scalping DLC for those games. Yeah. Dude, a Blood Meridian DLC or or play like like community mod of Red Dead that's just Blood Meridian, yeah, that yeah. would fucking rock. Does anyone know how to hack? Can anyone? Yeah, I think a lot anyone, of people know how to hack. If anyone knows how to do that, and they can fucking hack Red Dead Redemption Two to make a fucking Blood Meridian mod <laughs> to make it more brutal, where you can kill more Indians. Yeah, just go down. <laughs> you're going down to Mexico and scalping people in Mexican towns to hand in their scalps to the Spanish government. <laughs> Damn, is that what happened to Blood Meridian? I got bored and stopped reading it. Yeah, the, well, the kid joins uh, that gang. The Gleason gang, I forget the name of it, but they get, yeah, they, they get contracted by the Mexican government to scalp like Comanches or whatever. 
Nice. And, uh, you know, they get money per scalp. So they're just going into like Mexican towns and killing everyone. <laughs> like, Jesus taking Christ. their scalps and like just t- turning them in like Chuck E. Cheese tokens. <laughs> oh, nice. I'm going to get the Dracula teeth after I kill that Mexican family. Yeah. I'm going to get the bouncy ball, the Dracula teeth. Yeah, I got a little spider ring from <laughs> killing. <laughs> Yeah, that shit is good. Can't you play that shit online? Red Dead? Red Dead? Yeah. yeah I never played it online. Because that's the thing. This single player is so good, I don't want to, like... Yeah, taint it. Yeah. It's the appeal of the game is that there's a special relationship between me and Arthur. Of course. Of and then course. you go online, there's all these other people that also know Arthur. It's like being in a polyamorous relationship. It's, <laughs> it's disgusting. Yeah, I'm with you, dude. It's fucking gross. Yeah, I don't want to be cut. It's gross. There's too many ponytails involved. It really is like the end of the movie, Her. Mm, I've never seen the end. Does he realize she's she she had? Well, yeah, all the AI stuff. is linked, and they're in a relationship with a billion people. And then oh, everyone, it's all like linked. Couple, yeah, everyone has to come to terms with the fact that they're all like just in love with computers in general. Wow. Yeah. So the, so every so damn, and he jack. She sees his cock and shit. Doesn't he jack off to it? I guess I saw that in theaters, and I don't really remember much about it. I remember not liking it. Yeah, seems like bullshit to me. It, yeah, it's bullshit. I would never fall in love with a computer. I would need some flesh and blood titties attached. I wouldn't even fall in love with a woman. <laughs> I think that's. I think they're a type of computer. <laughs> that is true. The 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 female brain is a processor. Yeah, that's broken. Mm-hmm. Yep. I found a Reddit for like uh, like video game collection. <clears throat> Oh fuck! Yeah, to show how many video games you have, and there's people that like just have rooms. They're like my my collection room. (laughs) (laughs) It's so fucking gay, dude. (laughs) It's really all. It's really sad, dude. Yeah, (laughs) it's like that's that's what they aspired to. They were in like 1993. No, you know what? It's not even. Yeah, that's sad. What's even sadder is there's a guy being like, "Damn." Yeah. And he has, like, half of that many games. <laughs> you know yeah. what I mean? Like, there's a guy who's not even that guy who wishes he was. Yeah. No, because I was, like, I was looking at old, uh, I don't know, sometimes I just I read about connectors and video signals or whatever. I, I forget where it started. I think I started, like, reading about, like, console televisions. Mm-hmm. Do you remember those? Like the big tube-ass motherfuckers? Well, yes. The ones with a VCR in them? No, the ones that, like, look like a fucking, like a... Yeah, like a credenza. Oh, yes. like a piece of yes. furniture. Yeah, yeah. they like got their wood box. Yeah, yeah. Fake from like the '60s. Yes, yeah. I fucked with those. Yeah, my grandpa had one, and uh, it's like we, you know, you just accept things, but then you get older and you're like, what the fuck was that shit? I know. It's like, well, yeah, it's it's also a table or something. Yeah, yeah, it was just furniture, dude. Yeah, uh, you know those, and then I started looking at uh, like Sony CRT reference monitors. Apparently, the video game community, the retro gaming collection community, they buy these like Sony uh, like reference monitors that accept like an RGB signal because mm-hmm. it makes. I mean, you, there's no the way quality it is better. The, zero chance it makes it better. Yeah, there's fucking no chance in the world. <laughs> yes, it look better than just using whatever cable. Hundred percent. Super Nintendo. I agree with that. And then there's these guys that spend like twelve hundred dollars. On shitty, outdated technology that like doesn't make sense to use at all, and then the monitors themselves are like fucking fourteen to twenty inches. Yeah, oh, tiny. What? Yeah, it looks awful. Like a kitchen TV. Yeah, but then you know the boxes are huge because they're made for like, like, uh, like network news rooms and shit. Oh so shit! You yeah, can like yeah. monitor recordings and make sure that they're like color accurate. What? Yeah. Damn, and, uh, that sucks. I saw a thread on Reddit where somebody's like, I just picked this up for $900. <laughs> and then one guy's like, yeah, that's really stupid. This is all just junk. You're just collecting garbage and selling garbage to each other. And all these like these replies are like, you're in the wrong subreddit. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting all defensive about it. just blowing their parents' money on news TVs. I cannot believe there's a market. For, like, wouldn't they be able to just find that in the trash? Um, I <clears> guess <throat> there's probably an application for like smaller. Like, you do probably do need color accurate monitors for video applications if you're doing something with that. But no, it's probably entirely propped up by one retard on like these 
v- retro gaming forums like 10 years ago is probably like, well, look what I did. And then the rest of them are like, yep, that'll legitimize my gay ass hobby. <laughs> <laughs> what are they even playing? Like fucking Atari? Yeah, they're playing like fucking Super Mario World. That sucks, dude. <laughs> yeah, like regular that Nintendo. sucks. It's really stupid. Oh my god! Especially because I just played. I they they put like all a bunch of Super Nintendo games on Switch. I just replayed Super Metroid, and I guarantee you, you're not having a better experience. Not even close. Not yeah. It's so easy. You do it at a, on a whim. You just download the shit. You yeah. play it for like eight hours. You're yeah. done with it. It's great. I love it. It's yeah. a great game. I don't need a fucking network news television from 1997 oh my god that's really sad man imagine how little pussy those guys get yeah (laughs) just negative amounts of pussy yeah oh yeah probably never yeah yeah they don't have sex (laughs) they've never even honked a tit (laughs) oh my god that fucking sucks dude (laughs) like being nerd being a 38 year old man who's nervous to talk to a woman yeah There was a guy like that who would do open mics in D.C. This guy that was, like, fat and bald and ugly. It, was like, it wasn't even like if he lost the weight, he would still be, like, a, yeah. z- a zero. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> like an absolute, there's no path. There's not, there's not, no path to push. There's no way, yeah. And uh, he would just constantly get fired from jobs for <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and he lived with his parents, and he just he was like forty two, and just like never even got a taste. Oh, ne- never once. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck. Yeah, they were like, people were like, why? Like, why? I remember asking, like, why doesn't he just buy a prostitute? And they were like, I don't know. Like, you get to that point, and it's like you just give up on it. And it's like, fuck. That's brutal. damn. Oh, he, he just like doesn't dude. even get horny. At yeah, that he had point. a he had a stroke, I think, and uh, then it got even worse. Damn, his dick got even softer. Yeah, his life got worse. He, like lost function, and so he never had sex. Never. Oh fuck, dude. Damn, I I gotta say it is cool to have sex. Yeah. I wish I never had sex. You can stop. I'm never going to stop, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I love this shit. Dude, I'm literally obsessed with pussy, and it's exhausting. Nice, man. Are what you? do people... People say that online. They're like, I'm so exhausted. Yeah, I'm, exa- I'm, exa- I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. So I guess we're going to really get into Apex Legends mm. today. You're listening to the Video Gaming Podcast. The, the Gaming Chat. Uh, my name is uh, Eric... Schmidt, what is it? What's a good name for like some gaming a guy who would have a gaming podcast? Um, hmm. Yo, I'm Brian Frintz. <laughs> Frintz is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, this is Brian Frintz and Eric Schultz, and this is the <laughs> the Gaming Dudes Podcast <laughs> Hour. Yep, where boop, we, boop, 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 boop. yeah, just talking. Audiences are small. Yeah, talking, oh, talking, talking with that I've never that, had f- that like insecure cadence that. Yeah, the guys fit. have on podcasts. Right. So, what are we doing today? Tell me we, about it, man. We got some. We got <laughs> Come some, on. Yeah. Oh God. What are we going to talk what about? What are we going to? What's on the? What's on the agenda? Uh, stay tuned. We got some really cool stuff. <laughs> That's <laughs> good. Yeah. Right after right. our theme uh, song, we got we got some really cool things coming up. We're going to be talking about some really sick games <laughs> 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 on the Cool Guy Gaming Podcast. Uh, just some really cool stuff. Check it out. Yeah, uh, they spent like th- they hired like an animator yeah. like for five thousand um, dollars to do an yeah. animation <laughs> with their Mega Man, <laughs> yeah, 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 and yeah, yeah. no <laughs> one gives a fuck. It's like <laughs> a minute and a half long. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah my, I had to borrow. To- I had to borrow seventy thousand dollars from my mom for a <laughs> podcast studio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, really cool stuff. So check it out. Uh, <laughs> God damn, that shit sucks. Yeah. Now they all do that voice too. It's I like because they they're just worried about, you know, they they probably have confidence in person, but the idea that someone they no can't they do, see, they don't have confidence someone that can't person. they can't see is listening to them it destroys them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like how, yeah the fact that the tape is running it freaks them out. Yeah. Yeah, which you know I get it. Unlike you know, we that's why we have the golden tape recorder. 
Yeah. For whenever yeah. to always. We don't give a fuck if it's running or yeah. if it's not. We always so have record. So check out that shiznit, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> Dude, epic. I love on podcast. Epic. Yeah. <laughs> when they even approach a joke, they laugh so fucking hard. Too yeah. much. When yeah. it's just we don't not do even. That. We no. never laugh no. at jokes. I've never, I've never laughed at anything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> every every basketball <laughs> podcast I listen to is just like, they'll just be like, what do we call it? it was a fr- oh, a free. Uh, oh, I called it a foul throw. And then it just gets such a laugh. And they're like, I like that. I yeah. like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dude, remember when Scotty said a uh, foul throw? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Crazy, crazy. Fun stuff. games, really cool prizes. We got really cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and we've got a new sponsor. Yeah. And it's just like his stepfather's yeah. drywall business. Right. This is <laughs> like, like, if you're in the greater you. Fort Wayne area. Uh, again, every episode of the show is brought to you by our friends at MarineCorpCoffee.com. <laughs> uh, Marine Corps Coffee. It's the kind of coffee that says who I, you know. Uh, it's for veterans. First responders. Look, if you've got flags all over your fucking dumb house. Mm-hmm. You got one of those flags with a blue line blue going through in the middle. Huge. Yeah. Police. A Punisher sticker. Blue Punisher truck. with blue stripes. Yeah, with a blue stripe. <laughs> mm-hmm. So you asked for it, folks. That's right. And you got it. I have reinstalled Modern Warfare. <laughs> <laughs> and I will. Nick is holding the controller. They I are will. fetching his online profile right now. Oh, there's an update. You're oh, lucky. Oh, good. No, oh, that's a fast update. No, but, it but it requires, requires a restart. restart. Wow, you guys harmonize so well. I know. Requires a restart. Stop and I used to be in an acapella group, barbershop yep. quartet. Mm-hmm. Do you think back back in the day, barbershop quartets got pussy? No, they all fucked each other. About, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. How about a, a jar bar shop? A jar bar shop. <laughs> okay, that's something. And it's an Indian <laughs> business. Hey, so, what's up with this guy, Modi? He seems like a real piece of work, this guy. What the uh, fuck is yeah, this shit? Uh, what's I he doing? Ooh. He's a Hindu nationalist. All right, I don't want this. This is very loud. I don't know what the fuck's happening. Whoa, this guy has a cool fucking mask. Because it's a modern warfare. Yeah, but I don't is want... Is he an insurgent? In modern wars, you get mad. Look how gay this is. They put girls in the... Everyone's a girl. It's a girl who just got her hair done. Yeah, yeah. In the middle of a <laughs> fucking combat zone. I think people fight as girls now because it's harder to hit them. The hitbox is smaller, I hear. Fuck that, dude. Because of uh, Fortnite. Yeah, take the girls out of video games. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, yeah, I held my I held my tongue on these issues for. Whoa, is this guy a terrorist? He looks cool. I'm, I'm rooting for the terrorists because they're guys. Well, dude, no, dudes they're rock. dress cooler. I mean, yes, dudes do rock, and dudes this is rock. this is the era. This is the come town dudes rock era. By mm-hmm. the way, for anyone that was cons- was uh, confused, yeah. yeah, dudes rock, dudes rock. Elizabeth Warren, Elizabeth Warren, time, suck, time's suck up. Yeah, every morning it's I wake time, up. The time's up movement is the response. <laughs> To me too, mm-hmm. and it means times up. Time for pussy. Time <laughs> <up>. <laughs> we did the countdown. To times up on not count, fucking countdown to you complaining before it's pussy getting high. <laughs> <laughs> before it's fucking. Oh my god, Har- Harvey's pussy uh, pussy dude. patrol is yeah. <laughs> Harvey's pussy patrol. Har- Harvey's the pussy HPP posse. dude. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That man is over there acting like he can't even walk. I know. Yeah. What does he think is going to happen? They're going to be like, well, I guess he didn't rape since he yeah. can't walk upstairs. Yeah, that's my plan. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Nick and I, I were talking about this hacking. the other day. Mm. <laughs> like when I get caught for computer The hacking. Junior Soprano move. Yeah, if, yeah. We, if we ever have to go to court, we're going to get neck braces. Yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Matching neck braces. That's pretty good. <laughs> and we're going to crap our pants right there and then. Dude, I can't get over how cool the insurgents looked in this game. It makes you want to root for the insurgents. Oh, well, I maybe that's what do. they're doing, dude. Maybe this is a fucking, uh, fucking Nazi a game. You can, and do- they make the good guys girls, and they make the insurgents cool guys, and that way they're making the making them all, you know, mm-hmm. making them all Nazis. Yeah, you can. Uh- you can do this shit where you uh, like execute people if you sneak up behind them. Nice. And it changes to third person and shows the animation. Whoa. And it, it's like half the players are girls now, so you can just go up and slit a woman's throat <laughs> in the middle of... <laughs> Damn. In the middle of, like, you know, whatever, whatever this is. Russia, I guess. Do you think some of this is... There are a few people that realize they're trans by playing with women? 
Uh, maybe one of these you. games. Maybe, I think there's maybe that's why you don't been... like video games because you're worried about that happening. Um, I but, love video games. There's definitely been like a 25. <laughs> I'm just not good at them, <laughs> and I'm not worried about it. I would love to be a woman. Unfortunately, I I'm a straight man. There's definitely been like who a, would get head from a girl a girly enough man. Uh-huh. So maybe I'm bi. Yeah, but mostly on the Kinsey scale, I would say I'm a four or whatever or one. Which or two, whichever one is like mostly straight, but might get his cock sucked in the right. Mm-hmm. You catch him on the right day. <laughs> <laughs> you catch me having a really good or a really bad day, and I might get my dick sucked by you if you're a cute man with like lipstick on. Yeah, you because you want lipstick on the dick. I want no. I mean, I guess I just want him to look like a woman. You want his nails did? At least, at least they don't and, have to be fully a full set mm-hmm. and dang- but, dangly earrings. That, that elongate his neckline. I don't know about all that. Okay. I don't I'm need just, that. I'm just trying to ask you what kind of guys you're into. <laughs> <laughs> mm. uh, there was a guy who had a face like a woman that I saw, and I was like, damn, I probably would catch a, some dome from this guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Trying <laughs> 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 to write jokes at a coffee shop. <laughs> you're imagining about some guy buying coffee, sucking your dick. <laughs> you're like, yeah, I'm a straight guy. It's him that's gay. He's yeah. the one that's gay. So not I me. found him and I beat the fuck out of I him. I beat the for shit out of him. those thoughts. That fucking homo, dude. How dare he? No, nah, I smiled at him. What I do you said, think What's this up? is? The Matthew Shepard story? I wonder worse. if there's a new Garfield game coming out. That would be good. I'll be into that. <laughs> you get the fuck. Is Odin there a the game? Ass. Was there ever a new Garfield tri- game? Triple A Garfield game? <laughs> <laughs> you just have to like check your lasagna stats. All the, <laughs> the Simpsons video games were awesome. No, I mean there was the, the arcade, arcade one at the arcade. Awesome. Yeah, that was the end of an era. Fuck, dude, that game ruled. Yeah, like how you hit Shouts people out with your Have you played pushes. it again as an adult? No. no. It sucks. It sucks. Really? It really sucks. Yeah. It's not fun. I mean, I, I used to go to an arcade and, and play. It's yeah. fun to do with, like, a girl. Yeah. yeah. You know? Because then she can suck your dick. Yeah, uh, that's the nice experience. That's what I... My pleasant memories of going to arcades is that your dick gets sucked afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> and then you both pretend like you had fun at the arcade. Because <laughs> it's like, we're, I'm like... I don't know about you, but like I, I, I'm at the age where like I just missed arcades. Like, yeah, was, I missed them. Yeah, it was yeah. like one or two times. No, during. mine is... My memory of that Simpsons game is from Chuck E. Cheese's. Yeah. From the Chuck E. Cheese's in... I don't remember where... I think it was Gold North Point or some shit like that. And it was like the like cool adult game. It's like when you weren't a baby. Yeah. Like all the babies are playing whatever Chuck E. Cheese game, but it's yeah. like you're cool. You're like you're nine. Mm-hmm. You're playing Simpsons. You're like I'm not a baby, and then uh, like a bunch of like eight year olds are like, yeah, you're a baby. You're like I'm 27. <laughs> <laughs> no joke. I was having lunch with Christina today. She's being bullied by fifth graders. <laughs> They're like, look at this baby. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a man. Yeah, I'm 30 years I'm old. I'm 30. Yeah, <laughs> like I gotta I gotta meet up with my friends from elementary school. Oh, you still keep in touch with them? I mean, no, they're in elementary school. Yeah. <laughs> I literally do keep it. Pete and Eldis are literally my friends from elementary school. <laughs> um, You're nine years old. I was eating lunch with Christina today in uh, Park Slope, and a baby came up to me. She like she she saw mm-hmm. me through the window and like pointed at me and like waved to me. And I think it's because I look like a giant. <laughs> I think I think a baby was like, yo, yeah, there's a big, big ass me. Yeah. yeah, dude, no joke. She was smiling so hard and was like waving. Yeah. <laughs> like her parents literally had to like pick her up and like she's like thought I was a giant baby. <laughs> it was so fucking awesome. That's so funny. You're yeah. the only other baby it's seen. Yeah. She, like thinks yeah. that's what she's gonna grow into. <laughs> <laughs> that's hurt the ideal the games. ideal lifestyle fat mm-hmm. video games yes, lifting check, weights check uh completely just not fucking your girlfriend ever mm-hmm. <laughs> emotionally checked out she doesn't know how to process it yes you know mm-hmm. she's like why is this disgusting man not fucking me? right mm-hmm. i know? love this piece of shit <laughs> for some reason <laughs> she's mad at herself because <laughs> she loves you <laughs> she, can't, she can't understand it at all she wants to hang out and i'm like I have things I have Come to do. Come on, bitch. It's Lamont. And there's bay windows in my apartment. <laughs> She's walking by and sees me feeding Doritos to Ernest. <laughs> you yell at her for walking in front of the TV. Yeah. <laughs> you fucking bitch. <laughs> Say pause. <laughs> Tell Say me to pause. <laughs> Why are you spying on me? I told you I was fucking busy tonight, bitch. 
<laughs> you and Ernest having a tea party. <laughs> Go hang out with one of your one of your collection. You put of a little fat bow tie on Ernest. You're like, Thank you, Mister Ernest. I tell you, it makes you feel like a real piece of shit. But walking all over a woman, <laughs> mm, what a great feeling! <laughs> I immediately Just went to, went to the train station. Mm-hmm. Bought a ticket to Saint Denis, mm-hmm. which is their New Orleans. Okay, I found Ooh. a Chinese person. <laughs> I tied his ass up, put him on a horse, <laughs> drop him off on the train track. <laughs> okay, that's what the game. It's a game and of patience. So it teaches you patience as you kill just hundreds of police officers waiting for that train to come by <laughs> to just fuck up that Chinese guy. They only have the Chinese in New Orleans in this game. That's the only place I've seen him. So this guy, he doesn't know how to ride a horse, doesn't mm-hmm. really know how to communicate with people or bathe or do anything. Okay. Well, you got to bathe them yourself. That's how, this is how I'm envisioning the character. That's yes, why I'm refusing yes, to yes, do any of these yes, things. Sure. Um, he's yes. covered in shit. I was going to say. Really, the only thing he knows how to do is go to New Orleans and tie up <laughs> Chinese people. <laughs> and unfortunately, that's not a business yet. Not yet. It's no. going to be another 100 years or so. So you just have to keep riding the horse around, finding all the Chinese people in the game and finding different ways to kill them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, how does truly train suck my dick? Tickets. Wait, hold on. Let me see if I got a, a bounty out on me. Because I have been doing some crime arenas. Oh, no. Good. No bounties. You can pay your own bounty? Uh, Yeah, you just not. All right, let's see. What the fuck is Ansberg? Sounds like they got good pussy over there. Yeah. Some bitch named Ann. Where's all y'all got pussy over there in Ansburg? <laughs> <laughs> Mister, I was wondering if I could get my penis sucked at your train station here. No, I gotta leave. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, you're sitting on the train now. Yeah, look at my man. So training could, it could up. you theoretically kill? Everyone yeah, you literally are <laughs> covered in shit. Your pants are <laughs> completely covered yeah. in shit. Yeah. All right now. There was a Chinese guy here before, but now it looks like it's one of these guys. Now it's a black guy. Now it's a black guy. So, I don't know, man. I don't think you should rob him. Maybe maybe I'll just stand too close to him until he gets upset. Oh, don't put no evil eye on me. I don't know what that even means. That's... He's he's (laughs) trying to get the fuck out. What are you you all riled up Do you remember the black guy in Deadwood? The guy that worked yeah, in the stables. Yeah, the N word, right? Yeah, the N word general. <laughs> he was a great character. The N word general. Yeah, that was his character's yeah. name. Yeah. You don't remember that? I've never seen it. He yeah. rocked. Oh, here's your one here's, of your boys. Yeah, finally, we got it. Damn. Damn, gotta, he looks like Raiden. Oh, he's not fucking around either. He's coming at you with some weird body language. Also, his ponytail's awkwardly stiff. Yo, you gotta fuck this guy up, yeah, dude. Yeah. You're going to take that kind of disrespect yeah, from a fucking... On. No, I'm going you know to follow him out of this thing so there's no witnesses. Smart. Look, trust me. I've been tying up Chinese fellas. <laughs> <laughs> you are like a dog trailing me. He doesn't like it, dude. You are not the bother. This okay. is great. You guys got to talk while I do this. Yeah, That's a stop. Way tell to us carry about on. your. Uh, oh, now we want to talk about. Oh, you got a witness for disturbing the peace. Yeah. He's gonna fucking tattle on. Well, him. look. Here's the thing, man. Damn, you're choke. You're straight choking the Chinese guy in front of everybody. Oh, Ooh, knocked his come ass on, man. out, bro. Damn. I just look. Time up. Time up. This Chinese guy gave me a hard time. Time up. I didn't start anything with this man. <laughs> He's this got snake oil. This guy. Damn, you're started. just walking out carrying another man. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys could that be looks friends. like you're about to have Shit, a lot of sex with him. We got the, lo- we got the law man on coming out here. The ponytail in the Chinese say, guy is not very dynamic. I want to no. say. Th- I want to say this. Yeah, the ponytail hangs up. That it sucks. hangs up. Yeah, that's a review. Um, Rockstar that's a good games point. suck our fucking. Is dicks, it Rockstar bro? games? Yeah, the same people that make GTA. Yes, of course. All right, it's I don't basically know. the same game. Yeah, Look, it's the same I'm game. wanted for kidnapping now. Now let me ask you this: It's 1898. You see a Chinese guy say to a white man, "What the hell is your problem?" And then the white man beats him to death. <laughs> right. And carries and him throws the him to a lake into the body. <laughs> throws him into the body. Feed him to alligators. I don't know if the cops are really gonna follow <laughs> that, up on that one. No. It, it was tell. It was show me where the crime is. Uh-huh. That's a parking ticket in what crime? Yeah. What crime has been committed here? Just trying to feed a Chinese man uh-huh. to alligators. <laughs> they write you a ticket for polluting the alligators' diet yeah. oh, they with had unhealthy no oriental meat. 
This is gonna be great once I finally get to those alligators. Are there alligators? There's absolutely fucking alligators. Hell yeah! You can definitely feed a Chinese man to them. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, uh, these are the best goddamn games. Wait, yeah. have you you can feed human <laughs> beings to alligators in this shit? <laughs> I'm going to try it out All right. and see what happens. Well, we'll keep you posted, folks. <laughs> Nick it has a Chinese man with gray hair slung over his shit-covered <clears throat> character's uh, shoulder, just painting the scene here for you. We're in a beautiful bayou, um, lots of fucking water, lots of stagnant water, the kinds, frankly, that a mosquito would go crazy for. Uh-huh. Nick's now got a $10 bounty on his head. That's he how much the keeps- punishment is. You you get you get some multiple witnesses see you kidnap a Chinese man from his business Ten right bucks. with the express purpose of feeding him to alligators <laughs> <laughs> and the I fine is ten dollars. I don't see any gators, man. No, they're here. Trust me. You might need a new plan. What is your backup plan for this Chinese man? No, it's, there's no backup plan here. Can you have sex with his lifeless body? <coughs> you can't have sex with his lifeless body, but you can't put him on the train tracks. Can you have sex at all in this game? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But he's oh, always are these like, hobos? Can you fuck these he's hobos? He's always mad there about like, hobos, anti-white You don't belong racism. here, now get. You don't belong here, mister. But uh, yeah, I'm looking for alligators to feed this Can Chinese. you feed them to wolves? I can feed them to wolves, but again... I want to feed this Chinese guy to alligator. Is that an alligator? Yeah, it was, but he, there. Fuck. Oh, there he is. Yeah. That's a little baby gator, though. It's a baby gator. We need a. That's an Adam sized dick. We need gator. A, bill, a big fella. I need a big gator. <laughs> I love to have six with gators. <laughs> All right. Oh, what the fuck? The Where your horse is going? like mud. The horse is afraid of the alligator. Oh, the Fucking baby. bitch ass horse. You should so. kill your horse. Your horse follows you around like a buddy? Yeah. Now, in real life, in real life, if you had to perpetrate a crime against a Chinese man, what would it be? Now, keep in mind, this Chinese guy isn't dead. He's just knocked out. Okay. So the hope is that first, the first hope is that these alligators will take the bait. Sure. That's hope number one. The second (laughs) hope is that he'll wake up screaming as the alligators (laughs) consume his body. Wait, so this is your first time doing this? I've never done done this before. before. Okay. So we're going to find out if this game is good or bad. Okay. I I do not have a good feeling about you being able... Yeah, you're right. That is the whole basis of whether it's good or bad. It's whether you can (laughs) feed it on the show. Whether you can feed a Chinese man, a live Chinese man, the alligator. The knocked out Chinese man. Here's a snapping turtle. Oh, they can fuck some shit up. See if they'll eat his nuts. Snap on his nuts. Get him. Sick Get him, him, Mr. Turtle. Sick him, boy. <laughs> Look how slow he's going. Get nah, him, he's Mr. turned turtle. around, dude. Can you bait him? Oh, you're lassoing him. Oh, you're you're trying try to lasso, lasso the turtle. The snapping turtle. You suck dick at lasso. But the, the lasso isn't going to work on the snapping turtle. Mm-hmm. So we're going to pick this guy up and put him in the way of the turtle. Okay. And so here we go. The Chinese man is now covered in mud. And now Nick is placing his body in front of the snapping turtle. Let's and see. let's see let's what the... See s- he, he just kind of no, nudges just him. just walked past him. No, he just turned all the way around. Ugh. All right. Snapping turtle maybe not be the answer. You should kill yeah. the snapping you gotta turtle. You got to find a gator now. You should kill the snapping turtle and uh, make... Ooh, damn, that sucks. You're stabbing oh, him through the shell? Fuck, dude. Yeah. That poor fucking gay-ass turtle. All right, so we're going to pick the Chinese guy back. All right, Chinese guy's getting picked up. (laughs) (laughs) And now we look look for alligators. (coughs) Oh, there's one. Oh, here we go, baby. That's a big boy. That's a fucking alligator. Now, I got to piss him off. What if you slit the Chinese guy's throat? You got to piss him off first. That's Uh Oh, he does not like that. drop Drop it. Run away. No. Come on, eat him, eat him. This game sucks. Eat, eat him. him. Eat the Chinese eat guy, the Chinese Mr. Alligator. Guy. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. Uh, come on, Mr. Mr. Alligator. We got a Chinese fellow over here for you. Come on. Come on, Alligator. Come on, eat the Chinese right, guy. Yeah, get this, put this on Instagram so people know. Eat the Chinese guy. Yeah. We're trying to get this Come alligator. 
trying to get this alligator to eat this Chinese guy. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for paying us so much money. Yeah. We really don't appreciate that. that. Don't mention the money. Okay. Don't mention the money. All right. Sorry this about that. fucking horseback over here. Whatever, man. We got to... I feel like this has been a failure. Yeah. yeah. So just go ahead and kill the Chinese guy, I guess. All right. Kill the Chinese guy with a bow and arrow like his ancestors would have wanted. Ooh, yeah. That's another aspect of the game we should explore is... Mm-hmm. Putting a fucking bow, yeah. All it's right. far more. What if you hit? What if you hit the crocodile with, with one the... bow and arrow to anger him? Yeah, a croc can survive at least a couple of bows. Come on, hit him with the bow, dude. A couple of arrows. I mean, I could, I could kill this mother. Nah, probably. just make him angry, so that maybe he'll eat the Chinese guy. Oh, oh. you straight got that motherfucker. He headshot him. Got your ass, Mr. All right, we'll here. skin his ass, dude. Yeah, make Get some, some shoes, gator dude. meat. All right, yeah. this went for being. A terrible podcast <laughs> to a disappointing one. I'm, I'm sorry, folks. I really thought the alligator would eat that Chinese guy. <laughs> I'm sorry, everybody. I let you down. Damn. Have you guys ever had gator meat? Oh, damn. Nick is just stabbing oh the God. hell out of this Chinese guy. Stop face. stabbing him. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Um, damn. That's that man is fucked up. They fucked that gay Chinese man up. Oh, oh damn! They got first person too. Ooh, fuck! <laughs> Come on, man. No, have you guys ever seen someone get killed in real life? It's really unpleasant. I mean, this games are so realistic now. Yeah. This is not even like... That's basically what it would look like to kill someone. <laughs> yeah. Would you think it would be that funny? No. It would just... I, I think it would... I would feel Your knife bad, would get stuck and shit. I would feel bad, but imagine uh -huh. feeding a Chinese guy to it. Imagine trying to feed a Chinese guy to an That would be funny. And it didn't work. That would be funny. Like uh -huh. trying to get a duck to eat bread. Yeah. But it's just an alligator and a fucking... The remains of a fucking... <laughs> Chinese motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs>